Bye bye, Elgato capture card. Yo. A pen? Yeah. Subscribers in the street wanting things signed. Look how I keep a sharpie in the car. Yeah. Bye. Have a good rest yeah. of your day, guys. Cheers. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Absolutely gorgeous day today. That gorgeous that I should really be wearing shorts instead of long trousers and jeans and things. And I should have my flippy floppies on. Instead, for some reason, I'm wearing these massive Jordans, which I've had for about two years, and I took them to Australia, and they're absolutely battered. Like, have you seen these things? I need to get some new ones. These mean a lot to me, though, because a fan, uh, a fan, a subscriber of my YouTube channel actually designed these on the Nike ID website, and I love the design that much, I went and bought them. So they've got a sentimental value to me, as far as that's concerned, but I do need to get some more. So guys, this morning, I've been to the post office, posted off an Elgato that I gave away on my Snapchat. Guys, I'm doing like, I did a giveaway yesterday on the YouTube channel specifically. I do a lot of giveaways on QT. I did a giveaway a couple days ago on my Snapchat for an Elgato. It lasted two days and I sent the Elgato off to the winner earlier today. So make sure you go and follow me on all my social medias because I'm going to be doing the giveaways on like Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, everything, Facebook. So go and follow all the social medias. They're in the description. I then took some rubbish from this room to the skip so we're a little bit clearer. Room looking super tidy. Got the boards up and a little bit of fan art. Welcome to Mars Media Plus, home fixed wireless broadband and wireless solutions. This is gonna be the website that's going to cater for all of the networking things that I'm gonna be doing. Well, on every new business, it's always good to tell everybody what the goal is. We specialize in the design and implementation for tailor-made public Wi-Fi and private Wi-Fi solutions to meet the needs for your business or residential clients. We will conduct a professional site survey with ESS software to find the best solution for your premises. Our services include installation of point-to-point, P2P wireless solutions, as well as general network troubleshooting and installations for small homes and businesses. Boom. That's enough for that though. That's enough for that. I've been websited out. I've been doing this for the last three hours. It's midday. I need some food. Good old Royal Mail. Cool. Yep. Thanks, man. Cheers, buddy. Oh, sweet, got my sub, got my post. I'm gonna go home for a bit. Hey! So about two years ago, I would have referred to this room as the gaming den. I did a series on my main channel, Mars Bar, where I literally, this is this is just a garage, right? We've got a garage door there and a garage door there. It's, it's a double garage, it's, it's quite a big space. But back in the day, a few years ago, I realized that it was an unused space. It was very, very badly organized. So I took it upon me to tidy it all up and turn it into what's called the gaming den. And boy, has that all failed now? It was good back in the day. We had a PS4 and Xbox One in here. We had some GTO Mega chairs, which are still here. They're over there. But now there's no projector screen anymore. The curtains, for some reason, folded up. The projector screen was motorized. You press this button and it brought down the screen. It all stopped. I don't know if you can hear that noise. Yeah, that noise. That's coming from the projector. The projector broke. The main part of the live streaming room. Unfortunately, back when it broke, I didn't have the funds to buy a new one, but now things are looking a little bit different. I could probably get a new projector and we could take this back up. But first off, I'm thinking about cleaning it out. For a start, it's got my old DJ gear here. I've got a smoke machine there and two of my massive pro sound speakers. Oh, no way. Swagways. There's my electric skateboard. I use that a lot. The nine bot. I can't find the charger for this. That is really annoying. We've got the mono rover. Oh man, it's been such a long time since I've been on a Swagway or something. Let's give this a go. Do you remember back a few years ago? Oh my god. Do you remember back like two years ago and these were a massive craze and they were just absolutely massive and if you had a Swagway you were literally one of the coolest kids around. Woo! But this Swagway was always better than everybody else's. Do you want to know why? Because it's got Bluetooth. Bluetooth device is connected successfully. It's connected. DJ I'm the one that Look at spice for the winter season, your chicken is a liquor season. 
Why have I not got my shoes on? That is my favourite lyric of this song. You ready for this? Your chicken needs a little season. <laughs> Your chicken needs a little season. That makes me laugh every time. I'm in love with you. I'm in love with you. So let me know guys if this is something that you want me to start and bring back up again See if we can recreate the ultimate gaming den and, and do a lot of the things like we've redone with the office Do a lot of the things in here that we could have done better last time and make it better Because it's all about learning from our mistakes and, and, and going forward and moving forward in a better way than we did the first time For example one of the things it was really cold in here so we could get some heaters or something just an idea, guys, let me know. Hopefully I've managed not to underexpose myself this time and you can actually see my ugly face. So this is my new business venture. No, not this, not this subway. What I was talking about earlier in, in the office, right? And I wouldn't say it's necessarily a new venture because doing wireless stuff has been stuff that I've been doing for the past, like, I want to say five or six months. But that was me, that was me providing a service and learning at the same time. I sell internet, I am an ISP, me, myself and I am an ISP for a few people in my neighbourhood, which is absolutely brilliant. I've done numerous wireless installs, the two that you guys have shown you is one at a, a, a place down the road, which I was doing that the other day, and another one at the Andrew Coffee House, both Wi-Fi provided by myself. But by the end of 2017, my goals are as follows. To have a working website for my wireless stuff, to redo and do more promotional video stuff, and three, to vlog the whole thing and have fun doing it. Jacob and I are making the most of this absolutely gorgeous weather outside today by spending a little bit of time together on the trampoline. You having a good time, bro? Yeah. Good lad. Back in the office, builders have arrived. I love this gorilla pod. So after this, when Andy has finished today, he's literally all he's doing is he's touching up a few of the beams. I want to ask a quick question actually, a lot of people were saying, well a few people said, Alex, you say, you know, you, t you talk about, you know, doing things yourself and how come you've got someone in paint in the room when it's so easy to paint the room yourself? Why haven't you just done it yourself? Why are you relying on somebody else to do it? Number one, not 100% sure why that's a big issue whatsoever. There's much more bigger things and problems in the world than worrying about why I'm not painting the room and someone else is doing it. The reason Andrew is there painting the room is because he gave me a price at the start which included the painting of the room and it was the only price he gave me and I okayed it. Him painting the room was included in the price. He's just finishing up doing a few little things and then it's time to start recording the main series. On the board that we installed in the live streaming room yesterday, the whiteboard, I've got each episode laid out as to what we're going to be installing and I think there's going to be five episodes, that including the finale which will be episode five. Am I worried about it? Yeah, I'm worried about it. I'm kind of worried about it. I'm thinking are things going to plan out the way I wanted them to plan out? Are the installations of things like the TV and the soundbar going to go smoothly? <laughs> Help if it have my keys. Right, I'll leave you to it then, mate. Yeah. Cheers, guys. Right then, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end today's vlog here. I really do hope you have enjoyed. I'm going to keep you guys updated on my venture within what I'm doing with the websites and things. And as soon as they're live, you guys will be the first to know so you can check them out and rinse me for any spelling mistakes or anything that I've said wrong. As much as I know you guys are trying to troll me when, when, when you do things like that, it actually does help me more than... Oh, it doesn't troll me at all. Correcting my mistakes is a good thing. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it greatly. If I say something wrong, if I <laughs> if I say something wrong, I want you guys to be in the comments section down below. Let me know what I've done wrong so I can correct myself. So guys, with that being said, I'm gonna head off today. I'll see you guys in the next video.